let's check out this five bedroom, three bathroom home in Culver City West, right behind. So this is a brand new remodel as we start here on the front. White picket fence, you can see all the beautiful flower features, the landscaping around us, the rocks on the floors, and a massive, look at that tree. You can definitely have your kids hang a, a little swing from there, maybe a little tire swing or something. It's just a nice little peaceful area to hang out. You look at the exterior, you see the stone features. But let's just go right inside through the front entrance. And this is it. Right as you walk into the home, you can see the open floor plan right away. And there is a good amount of space here in the initial front entryway. But you have dining area to the left side, easily can fit maybe six to eight people. Large picture window does look out to that tree, that front yard. And you can already see the remodeled beautiful kitchen directly in front of me. But let's take a turn to the right. I'm going to give you a full raw tour of this place. We've got the office space or in-law suite directly off the front door in an interesting design. It's not your typical square shaped room, but there is enough space to potentially fit a bed right there. You do have a fan up above and windows again looking out to the front, some closet space on the right side, but as we keep moving, we've got these two window doors, double doors leading into a little seating space and another bedroom, which would be your primary suite. But it is nice to have a primary suite with some extra seating area so you don't have to just only be in the living room, but check it out. It's very unique design, very unique home. It's not a brand new build. It is a remodel, but there is a lot to see in here, a lot of unique features. Here it is, here's the bedroom, California king sized bed here. Once again, another fan up above to the left. Let's get these lights on for you guys. We've got large walk-in closet right off the bedroom. And check it out, check out the view from here. I do like the little bit of greenery you can see on the side yard of the home through that window. Large king sized bed. And as we look into the bathroom here, pretty standard bathroom. They didn't go crazy, they didn't remodel this a ton, but you do have medicine cabinet in the behind the mirror, vanity, toilet, and full shower right next door. But let's keep on moving throughout the house, going to the other side through yet another window door. This leads into the back room that you can enter from the other living room on the other side of the house. Now this is a very large home, guys, and you'll be seeing throughout, but a lot of natural sunlight is coming into this space specifically. You can see it's just shining on me right here through the windows looking out to the backyard. To give you a quick peek of that backyard, you can see that there is a gate that leads to an alleyway, so you can pull a car into the backyard, and there's some storage in a shed out there. Design it how you like, a little space for a garden right there, plant whatever you need. This, is, this room is a very large size room. You can definitely have another sofa in here, another fan once again, and through this door, you got some storage space, a little closet. Let's keep on looking. Yet another door with some windows, and this one leads into the living area. Living area, very large, can fit a couple couches. Put a flat screen TV up on the wall where that picture is. And you've got the original fireplace with the original stonework surrounding it. That is a beautiful look, guys, I mean, this isn't your typical new modern house, but we do have, we do love the character that these older homes have to them. And then you've got the nice mix. Once you see the kitchen, I'm sure you'll agree with that. Let's take a look at the other side as you have the original wood railings going up to a second level. There's a lot of space. As I said, there's five total bedrooms in this home, but let's move on to this laundry space right before we hit the kitchen. Check it out, washer and dryer on the right side. If you don't wanna hear the washer and dryer a ton, you can always implement a door right there in front. And this leads us to the kitchen. Beautiful quartz countertops. These are the kind of kitchens you'll see in the expensive homes, the $5 million plus homes, pantry space on the right side, five burner gas stove, stainless steel appliances, hood vent above, plenty of countertop space as well. Brand new Samsung dishwasher, 
Always a plus to have a dishwasher. Who's trying to wash their dishes individually, solely, dish by dish? It's a waste of time, guys. Large stainless steel sink, and you've got a sink sprayer in that matte black faucet. I love the vein. Look at the veins here in the quartz countertops. It extends all the way up. That backsplash. And you've got a fridge air, stainless steel fridge and freezer right next to it. And probably my favorite part about this kitchen is the drop-down breakfast bar. They could have easily just extended this bar all the way to the end of the backsplash right there, but they decided to drop it down a bit. Maybe the kids can easily, comfortably sit at the breakfast bar. You make them breakfast every morning, cook up their eggs and bacon. They can eat right before school down here on this countertop space. I mean, look at that. Just take a look. Let's see. See how it would look if I'm just sitting here at the breakfast bar eating. I mean, this is a great angle right here, guys. Also, if you made it this far in the video, if you've seen this main floor, my name is Darren Kriz. If I didn't tell you that already, I have a real estate team out here. We help clients buy, sell, and invest property just like this every single day. We can help you remodel, design a home, rent it out, make some passive income because LA is always on the up and up. There are tons of offers on every single property that I show on this channel, and they go so quick. The turnover rate is very high with the new builds and the remodels that I show. If you have any questions at all, reach out. Email is down in the description below. We are happy to help and talk about all things Los Angeles coming from myself as a native Angelino out here. But let's keep on checking this house out to the right of your kitchen. Some pantry space, a little, some storage space, and then you've got another bathroom. This is a full bath, larger than the one in the other bedroom we saw. A lot more countertop space in there, toilet, tub, and new tile on the wall in that shower, actually. But that was everything, like I said, on this first level. Now we gotta go upstairs and show you what is up there, guys. So we do have nice carpet and the original wood railings heading upstairs, but let's do it. Go to the top floor and see what it's all about. See what the hype is about up here. Turn to the right, first bedroom, large bedroom, windowed closet, two windows. I meant mirrored closet in two windows and a little, little mix up there, but new carpet and you can easily put bed there, bed there, TV on the wall, lots of room in that bedroom check out across the hall. So you have a balcony as soon as you head up the stairs. That overlook, the backyard there, check it out. Lots of room on the balcony, even enough space for potentially a barbecue grill. You can see down there, you can actually see palm trees in the distance. Across the way, another bathroom. Look at these countertops with the integrated sink. Very unique look. It's not what we saw in the other ones for sure. It's a granite stone countertop. And you've got a shower, original shower, right there. But this is at a great price, guys. For this many bedrooms, this is a great investment property. You can rent out to people around here, tons. I know so many people that live in this area. We are about five minutes from Marina Del Rey, honestly, Culver West here. This bedroom is massive. All of these bedrooms are honestly very large in size. If you're seeing newer homes, newer builds, or even remodels, you're not seeing rooms the size of this one, the guest rooms being the size of this one, let alone the master bedroom. But that was everything for up here on the top floor. Let's head back downstairs, show you the kitchen again. Boom, we made it back down to this breakfast bar. Can't you tell I'm a big fan of this angle of this drop down quartz breakfast bar. It's a good look to this house, to this remodeled kitchen. Lots of space in here. That's what you're getting in a lot of these older homes. You're getting more square feet on the interior and you're getting more of a yard. It's rare to find a yard like this if you're gonna be living closer to the city, West Hollywood, Beverly Hills. But out here in Culver, Culver West, there are so many little pockets, so many suburban, residential, family neighborhoods. This is a great neighborhood specifically if you're looking into specific neighborhoods. And we're always close to the 405 freeway or the 10 freeway here in the Culver area. Less than 10 minutes from Marina Del Rey. You can bike to the water very easily or even walk if that's your thing. Go for a jog, guys. I mean, that's what everyone's doing out here in LA, am I right? But like I said, my name is Darren Kriz. I have a real estate team out here. We help clients buy, sell, and invest in property every single day. So if that's you or someone you know, reach out. We love to show you everything LA has to offer, not just what the media is telling you to think because there are 
beautiful new gems out here. People are making money on real estate every single day, I promise you, and you're gonna be upset in the next three years if you didn't buy today, because it's not about timing the market, it's about time in the market, so there's no better time to purchase a property then right here, right now. So shoot us an email. Like I said, like the video, subscribe, watch the other videos if you wanna see different homes as well, similar to this throughout the area. Also let me know what areas you wanna see homes to if you're looking to buy in the future. At some point, happy to answer any questions whatsoever. And we'll see you guys on the next video.